sit. Dead bird, way back. Heel. Heel. Come on, heel. Sit. No, leave that. Sit. Way back. There you go. That's it. Back. Good, way back, good. Good dog, good. Sit. Here, here, come on, here. Here, 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 here Ray, here, here, sit, sit. That's it. Way back, dead bird. Way back. Back! <clears throat> At a boy, good. Good, way back. Very good, heel. Right here, here, heel, right heel, come on, heel, back here, come on, heel, 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 here, 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 fetch it up, here, 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 sit, 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 way back, that's it, there you go, that's it, way back, back, Good, good. Way back, good. That a guy. What a good dog. Very good. Good boy, good boy. Heel. Sit. I made this one a tiny bit easier. I did move that pan for him compared to Wendy. Sit. Here. Heel. Come on, heel. Ray, heel. Here. Sit. That's it. Way back. Back. Good. One more. Sit, heel. Here. Heel. Sit. Good, here. Here, here, here. S sit. That's it. Back. Good. Heel. Here, sit. All right, easy. Heel. Easy. Here. Easy. Here. Here. That's it. Easy. Easy. Back. Good boy, easy. Easy. Here, 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 right here. Easy, easy, good, easy. Sit, heel, heel, sit. Here, easy, easy. Back. 
Good, easy, easy. Good boy. Here, sit. Here, here. Come on, here. Come on, here, here. Good, easy, easy. That's it, easy. Back. Good, easy, easy. Here, here, come on, here. Sit, 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 easy. Back. Good, easy, easy. Sit. Here. Sit. Here. Easy. Heel. Sit. Here. Easy. No. Heel. Sit down. I know. It's hard to see. Here. Here. Here, right? No. Sit. Here. Easy, easy. Looking long. Here. Ping pong in between the two white pans. Sit. Easy. Here, here. Here, here. No, no. All right, we're going to move up because he can't focus. Sit. Easy, easy. Here. Here. That's it. Back. Finally got it. Just had to move up a little bit. No big deal. Good boy. Easy. Good. Oop, that's it. Kept ping pong between that white pan and that white pan. So we just had to work with him. No collar correction there at all. So I was at a hunt test last weekend, and in fact, the last two weekends, and I've had several people come up to me in the gallery and ask me, how do I get my dogs to run perfect straight lines all the time, on marks and on blinds? And I have to tell you, I'm not the world's greatest at it. Uh, I'm not gonna sit here and tell you I'm the best one to watch on YouTube or any other social media platform. I'm just trying to pass along a little bit of knowledge that I have learned that has helped my dogs. And I have to credit uh, Bill Totten for that. He's a professional retriever trainer who is retired now. Uh, he helped me get a AFC and a Master Hunter on uh, two dogs ago. So he's retired, but I have taken some of that knowledge and I do it on my own. Uh, this is perfect uh, training alone for hunt, test, or field trial. So this is what's called a lining drill, not a handling drill. I'm not handling to these bumper piles. I'm trying to get them to go straight to them. There's long ones and there's short ones. I've got white pans on the long ones. I've got short orange pans on the short one. And I've got 10, 10 piles out there. So I've got five long, five short. I always go long first and then come back and do short second. So I try and get all the long piles first. So I start on the left, then I go to the farthest right one. So I'm working on the heel here. I'm trying to push and pull them on the line. So when they come back, I try and line them back up to the pile they went to, and then I try and bring them back around to the next one. So I'm working on heel in here, and even the subtle differences, just little movements, and you'll see the dogs kind of squirt a little bit to the right, to the left, or their head will move just a little bit here and there. That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking down on top of the dog. I'm trying to see where their eyeballs are looking, their little eyebrows, and I can tell if they're ping-ponging back and forth, or if they're looking over here, if they're looking over there, or they're looking right where I want them to. And when they lock in on it, it's, that's it. Pause for about three seconds. So they're focused on whatever they're trying to, where I'm trying to send them. Back. And I'll use voice inflection, which is a big thing I learned from Bill Totten, but I've, I've uh, also learned that from Dave Orm, for example. Uh, Easies, the second uh, go around. So the long ones are first. Those are the way backs. So 
bird cueing them way back, way back. And then I'll give them a good hard back. And when I come back and do the short piles, it's that's it, easy, easy. And I'm very soft voice, very, very quiet. And half the time judges can't even hear me say back. It's that, it's that quiet, just back. But you gotta be careful uh, in a hunt test or field trial because <laughs> If they hear you say back and the dog doesn't go, you're done. Uh, you had a no-go. So uh, even on the easy ones in competitions, I'll try and be just a little bit louder, but uh, not much. It's just back instead of back. So that's how that works. And that's how I get good lines. Now that was an example of a land series. Uh, typically, I run this in the springtime. I run this in the morning on land. It's gotta be cold out. They're running 10, maybe 12 marks here or 12, uh, uh, lining drills, the bumper piles, and they'll get overheated real quick. You got It's got to be cold out in the morning, and I usually do this in the spring and the fall when it's the coolest because they'll get overheated real easy. Uh, temperature out here right now I think is in the upper 30s or something like that, so which, which is perfect. Um, you can also do this on water. This is a perfect drill for water, and on technical ponds where you got a series of finger ponds or you got some points, and etc., you put these pans out. Uh, you can teach them to go over the point and then back into the other one, uh, bay and up along the uh, shoreline. It's perfect. And you just have to be creative. I've also put holding blinds out here in the, on the land series. I'll put out five holding blinds, some short, some long. I'll make them go between the holding blinds. Right in front of a holding blind, I'll put a short pan. Uh, then put a long one uh, right up against it. So, I mean, you can get real creative on this drill. And it's just a lining drill. So, when I run blinds, I teach them A to handle through their basics and transitions, and that's double T and baseball and wagon wheels, etc. And then when they transition into more advanced, they, they start on this. And I run this even with my old dogs in the spring and in the fall, just to kind of tune them up a little bit. So it's a perfect drill for me to run when I'm alone training, there's no one around. Uh, this is one of the reasons I can, I can feel confident when I go up to the line and I look at any situation a judge will throw at me, and I just have to be patient with the dog. Just kind of, you know, get, as soon as they walk in on it, that's it. And they know when I say that's it, that's it. That's where they're going. And just give them the perfect, uh, or the appropriate inflection of back or back and start handling from there. So my dogs can handle, my dogs can line, and my dogs have confidence in me and I have confidence in them. Makes for a perfect scenario. And that's one of the reasons I run I won't say perfect blinds at hunt tests, uh, but I run good blinds at hunt tests, and uh, most of the time my dogs do well. They don't do well all the time. I mean, there's some cer certain situations where they could screw it up royally. So don't get me wrong. I'm not. I'm not here to, to boast that I'm the world's greatest uh, blind runner at all. So that's just the the drill that I learned, and I pass it on to you. And I wish you the best of luck in uh, your endeavors in hunt tests and field trials.